This video was brought to you by Marcus Beal, Elbil Mac, Abadur Planner, Stoltenberg, Camp Power, and Beal Componente. Yo, what's up? We're now in front of the house, and now we're gonna prepare for a family trip. And we're gonna do it with a Hi-Fi X. You know, what do you get when you order a Model X from Wish? Well, you get the Hi-Fi X. So, just copy Tesla, but don't make it too obvious that you copy them. <laughs> okay, anyway, man, look at the... Okay, okay, on jokes aside, these seats are way, way more comfortable than the Tesla Model X seat. The Model X seats, they have fixed angle and you can just tilt the whole seat, you know. But here, you have full business... No, 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 okay, this is, no, no, this is not business. This is first class seats. Oh, yeah, I prepared. Now, everything, let me show you now. So, uh, in the back here. This is a six-seater, so we have plenty of space. And here I put the baby stroller. This is Cybex e -Prium. Also, I brought the gay cable, always bring gay cable. So it actually fits with the third row up even. Yeah. So now I just have to get the baby and wife and we are ready. And you see here, it's this high five X or some shit. I don't know, I don't know Chinese. <laughs> Okay, so you see, this is heaven uh, compared to the hi-fi set, which is just too small. And here, okay, I think wife needs to clear the door a bit. Otherwise, you have to get out of the way. I just look, look how big the opening is. Uh, this is so comfortable. You see, we have space here in case I need to step up to do something here. I can, I, I can even do that. So now we just rotate and then flip out this and then we are good to go. And I don't know, but uh, Isabelle, you see, she's getting big, but she can still stretch it. <laughs> okay, let me just close it. Let's go. All right, so uh, I charged 100%, we are down to 99%. Uh, 399 kilometers is claimed. Now I don't have any navigation here. So, uh, and there is even no uh, screen mirroring, but whatever. I know the route. Uh, we're going to go to Nurby. Yeah, it's uh, a shopping center in Sweden. So let's go. It's 12.30 now. cruising at 97 which is 90 GPS speed and I figured out this is the best deal because um, wifey was complaining that uh, the car was not smooth when I went faster um, it was slowed down in the curb and it slows down quite uh, sudden or hard so um, yeah but uh, at least when you're cruising this slow then it doesn't slow down much uh, maybe sometimes it slows down by two kilometers per hour only yeah, but it's also good because consumption is not high, 266 only. And I figured out that the best deal uh, to... Uh, there's also another weird thing is that I haven't found a way to disable cruise control. Uh, you can enable cruise control, but yeah, for some reason, the only way for me to disable cruise control is to push the brake. So, yeah. and then every time I push the brake, then it has this certain deceleration, so that's why I put Regent on the lowest setting. And that seems to at least work the best for me. And then here we have the wireless charging pad. We have my phone here. See that we are 68 kilometers away from destination. So another thing is that Isabel needs to take a midday nap now, so we don't want to arrive too fast. So that's why it actually makes sense to go slow right now. She loves sleeping in the car while we are driving. But as soon as we stop, she will wake up. We 
we have now arrived at uh, Nubi Shopping Center. Fun fact, it's a Norwegian who owns this, this whole complex here. Big, big shopping center. <laughs> Isabel has woken up. And uh, yeah, so let me see. Consumption was 268 watt hour per kilometer. This car overports by 1.1%. But uh, let me see, how many percent do we have? We have to look here. 52%. Ooh, I mean, we could barely make it back, but uh, I want to top up. So fortunately, we have Mir Type 2 over here. Those uh, Delta charger doesn't work. Uh, all they don't count on any fast charger to work with the adapter. So, but Type 2 should work. Yeah. But let's see. So I'm gonna show you something cool. So I've been running the massage. You see, there. oh man, the massage here is so good, man. Chinese cars they have the best massage. But I notice also there's another feature here. If we go to camera. Uh, it says May, wait, male 20 neutral. So there's some AI trying to figure out. Okay, so I look like a 20 year old. Surprise, neutral. You see, I look like I'm 23 years old. Happy. Sad. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait, I got 27, 28, wait, how do I look older? <sighs> we need to test this on Wi-Fi. Oh, uh, sorry, I wasn't, yeah, I need to test it on Wi-Fi. So you can also do this. So you can switch to uh, uh, back camera. So I've been uh, checking out uh, what it looks like in the back there with uh, Wi-Fi and Isabel. No, 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 no. Do, do, okay, let's see, let's see. Oh, 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 nanai. Oh, oh, nanai. Female, 20, tw female 23, you see? She looks like 23 years old. <laughs> Happy. Can you make a sad face? Neutral 22. Wow, she looks young. 18. Oh, <laughs> 18. <laughs> Oh, yeah, we're charging, getting 10 kilowatt. Oh, it's funny. Okay, huh? Okay, I can see it here also. Yeah, yeah, 10 kilowatt. Yeah, so um, that's fine. It will take four hours and 40 minutes to finish charging, but uh, I think we'll stay here maybe at least uh, two, three hours. Man, it is quite windy today, so we need to do the wind test. No, 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 no. Man, I, I, I r quickly ran away. Come on, open. Oh, yeah. You see? Oh, the door is going to rip open now. It seems to have this reinforcement here. So it doesn't uh, go kaput. Okay, anyway, let's go over. Inside. Yeah. Isabel and wife is already inside. So we just let the car stay here. Let's lock it. Yeah, all right. Oh, wait, how was that? Wait. Okay, okay, okay. We are locked. Man, we came here on a weekday and there's almost no one here, see? In weekends, it'll be just packed. So we can either go for some Istanbul food, some Asian food. This is where we always go, Thai buffet. Uh, or there's also a food garden here. Uh, we, we don't dare to try it. Uh, yeah, but we, there's some people, but we're gonna go for the same one. Over here, over here, yeah, let's go, let's go. All right, I'm looking hungry, man, look. Unfortunately, they did not have that pork today, but at least this is roasted duck. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, yeah. Isabel. Oh, yeah. And then... Kids. At least, yeah, kids top this. They eat for free. Mmm, corn. Yum, yum. Maybe... Okay. <laughs> mm -hmm. All right, all good. Uh, now we're gonna go to a uh, toy store and you see Isabel is now one year and eight months She can walk just fine. She also started running <laughs> And in the beginning she didn't want to hold daddy, but now she actually wants to hold daddy. Yeah Yeah <laughs> She's so cute when she holds daddy like that <laughs> Let's go to the toy store eh? <laughs> Okay, we need to test if Isabel wants dolls. Baby, here you go. 
You want this? Baby, baby is a doll. You want the doll? Okay, next step is. Huh? What is it, baby? Achtung! Achtung! <laughs> and then. And then. And then. Is it better? Can you count to ten? One. Two. Until recently, there was only one baby shop in uh, Yasen. Um, yeah. We are thinking about getting another um, uh, baby, what do you call it? Yeah, uh, diaper table thing upstairs. So we have one downstairs, a big one. And then we just need a small upstairs. So, okay, we'll see. Oh yeah, look here, they have a Cybex Priam. But you see, this is regular Priam. You can distinguish it. If you look at the rod on the bottom here, the regular Priam unpowered is like this. E Priam, the battery is here. Yeah, so the battery is there, plus the motors are here, see? Wait, is this dual motor? I never actually noticed that, see? So, yeah, the one we have is not cheap. It costs around 20,000, no, 2,000 euros. Yeah, but man, this looks great, but we, we have the wife, you know? Yeah, wife is getting another baby. So we, we still kept the, the, what do you call it again? This is called, called carry cot. And we have to go back to using it and it is big you can fold it to be smaller but there's some hassle so normally you would just take the whole thing here and then put it in so <laughs> we have to go back to i don't know a big car soon in a couple of months man it is 5 30 already i don't remember how many hours we've been here but uh, now it's the last step which is to buy food uh, also some frozen stuff frozen food so um i told wifey to walk from there all over there to yeah euro cash and then i'm gonna move the car i think we have enough juice now anyway it costs uh, this is kind of expensive ac charging for five nook per kilowatt hour around 50 euro cents per kilowatt hour so uh, i should have plenty of juice let's see how it goes now oh 83 percent okay that's plenty yeah huh, eight hours. okay okay whatever um but anyway yeah i also need to bring some uh, uh, I have cooler bags. I also brought some IKEA bags. Yeah, they are really strong. They take lots of cargo. So I need to bring that inside there. And also, it's so windy outside. Uh, you see, we have to walk all the way over there. Uh, wifey doesn't like this weather. <laughs> but at least in there, we have a parking, uh, parking garage. And we can take the elevator right up there. All right, we are done, Dio. And we have some stuff in cooler bags here. And then Isabel prefers to sit in the shopping cart like this she doesn't like this anymore and she gets fed up uh, being in the stroller there so okay i could man oh okay let's go car is up there somewhere okay we put all the people in there and the cargo and the missing part is this so um you know during winter the front stays relatively cold at least it's not 20 degrees like in there it might be only five degrees here, right? So I have these two cooler boxes. They do insulate slightly, but I want to keep them as cool as possible. We have frozen stuff in here. So it's not that big, each, each of these cooler bags. And they barely fit <laughs> uh, compared to a Tesla. Uh, even the Model 3 has way bigger front than this, but especially Model S and also Model Y or Model X, they have way, way bigger fronts. This barely fits, but you see, it doesn't close properly. I'm not sure if I'm blocking some. No, no, there's some, there's a kind of hook there, two of them. For some reason, when I press it, it doesn't close properly. But if I just, I know it has soft close here. So if you just, okay, it, it stays in place there. So, uh, okay, it works. Now let's get back home. Wait, I just noticed something here. Uh, there is a gas station there and there are several cars queuing up. That's the refuel, that's fossil stau. <laughs> okay, they are queuing up to refuel. Well, well, well. Off I go. Straight home. Lol.
getting close to Oslo and now on the way back Isabel is awake so then we can just hammer it but the consumption goes through the roof we have 342 watt hour per kilometer now <laughs> but man the massage unlike uh, oh, 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 oh oh we have to play music yeah um, we have to play music otherwise uh, Isabel will uh, complain <laughs> but you know the um, the massage here will actually run indefinitely, unlike uh, the European cars, the German cars. They only run uh, massage for about half an hour and then they stop. So yeah, all right, let's enjoy the ride and enjoy 80s music. <laughs> Isabel likes the 80s, yeah, <laughs> that's cool. finally home now the temperature is plus two degrees Celsius it has been raining and we have a uh, shade the ease we have freaking slippery road now oh shit uh, how do I do this oh, oh, shit, shit, shit. oh shit. Um, wait, wait. I, I can't just slide down here I, I might actually slide into the house or some shit like that uh, it is super slippery Okay, 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 I have an idea, I have an idea. Okay, okay, if we, if we go... Okay, okay, I have an idea. Um, <clears throat> I need to get heated uh, floor here. Okay, 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 I have an idea. If you just... Don't break, don't break. Just go, go down, go down, go down. And then... <laughs> okay, okay, we just... <laughs> yeah, as, lo as long as we are now on the, sl the, the flat, then it's fine. Oh, shit! Oh, oh, the wheels are slipping. Oh, damn. I need to, uh, yeah, I need to put on some uh, gravel here. Holy macaroni. It's, it's, it's super slippery. Yeah, I'm going to order some uh, studded uh, shoes now from Stormbank. Look at this. Look at this shit, man. This is, this is dangerous. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, I had to figure out something here. But okay, okay, there we go. Finally, we hope. Well, I have to test now. How slippery is it here? I have put some gravel here. Oh, I can get up. Like a ninja. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, okay, no, it's the gravel. I, I have gravel here, okay. Wait, can the car get up? <laughs> can the car get up here? Uh, maybe you should test. Well, let's see, I have studless tires. If I just slowly crawl up in comfort mode, do I have an... No, no. Oh, oh, shit. Oh, oh, shit. Uh, okay, okay. I need more speed. I need more speed. Okay. Come on. We get the speed. We get the speed. Not a chance. Not a chance in hell. When hell freezes over, then yes. But it needs to be cold enough because now two degrees Celsius. Okay. Let me see. If I go all the way back. Okay, and then I try to go up. Just go, 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 go. Come on, come on. No, 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 no. If you start rolling, you have to quickly put in reverse and then control. If you try to brake, I can show you what happens if you try to brake. You will lose control. If you get up here, right? And then this happens, then you panic and then you brake. Then you have no control. Then you just slide without any direction so you you need to roll in the direction you're sliding then you can get, get some steering so the way i need to do it uh, until i fix this problem is that i have to roll into the garage yeah because here we have uh, enough traction and then i get enough speed and then i get up to here but then when i go down that is super scary if i go down then you just have to keep rolling keep rolling steer keep rolling steer try to break a little bit and then oh shit oh, i think it's time to get some pick duck oh. 
Okay, and since this is already a family video with some car stuff, I can show you the living room, what it looks like now. <laughs> you know, this living room is roughly 60 square meters large. Uh, when I live at Haugerud, you know, when I just bought Millennium Falcon, that was uh, 11 years ago, I live at 42 square meter uh, uh, apartment at Haugerud. <laughs> and now we have way more space, but look, look, look. It's not like uh, uh, Isabel doesn't have enough toys. The recent addition now is this. <laughs> Here, we have this in the living room. Uh, there's a slider, you see there's a slider, there's a car thing here. And also here you walk up there. And you can also ride on this thing here, so. Yeah. And we also bought this floor mat thing. It's actually for, for I don't know, how you call it a comp sport. It's like for martial arts and stuff like that. So it's two centimeters thick. So it's good for absorbing some some hits. This is how we play. Huh? Come on, Isabel. You go up there. Yeah, she climbs up. And I put this piece of cloth here because then we get less friction and more speed. And she knows that she... <laughs> go, 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 go. Come on, come on. Okay, you get up there, all right? Get down, get down, get down. Get down. Yeah. <laughs> and then, yeah, why not? A little, uh, I don't know what you call it. This, uh, maybe I think you, you're supposed to use this for, for swimming or bathing here, but uh, you can also put balls in it. Yeah, and then what else? Yeah, we got some toys. This, this we had this long time ago. It is from Amvina in Sweden. Yeah, uh, see, how is this going? You press. Yeah. <laughs> so, what else? We have the keyboard here. We have actually some Lego here, Duplo. Some other stuff here, yeah. Oh man, there's this nice chest with more toys in there. Holy macaroni. Uh, yeah. Uh, more toys there, more toys here. Yeah, more toys there. And this, this is the playpen. It's quite unique. You cannot find this shit in Europe, Norway. Uh, but we bought it from Thailand. We brought it with us on the airplane. <laughs> so, yeah, this is a nice place to sit. And also, we have, you see, padded stuff here. But so, shit, some of the toys got stuck. It's Ben. Can you stop it? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. What's that? What's that? Which toy is it, Isabel? She, she knew what toy it was. It's freaking Chinese. It's kaput. It's kaput. It's a bang. It's kaput. Kaput. It's kaput. It's a bell. It's kaput. Oh, you fixed it. You fixed it. Kepka. It's a bell. It was kaput. Can you say kaput? Kaput. <laughs> she's so cute. And we bought this from Sweden. Yeah, she's she's been playing here. No, it's, it's good now. It's nicht kaput. Nicht kaput. Yeah. All is good. You know, she is now in the age where she will she will repeat whatever we say, you know? If I try to say what's up. I sometimes say what? Is it been what? 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 Up. Up. What's up? What's up? Put. Put. <laughs> you like kaput, huh, Isabel? It's kaput. Kaput. <laughs> but yeah, anyway. So uh, now we have playtime. Kaput. <laughs> <laughs> oh, she's so adorable. She's one year and eight months now, roughly. Yeah, this is some Chinese stuff, man. I wonder how much Chinese she knows now. Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> but, uh, yeah. Actually, nowadays I feel like I have less time for videos and stuff. Because the family takes up, uh, takes my attention. 
Yeah. But I mean, eventually they will, they're gonna grow big. I mean, they're gonna grow fast, you know. So, but it's, b before we know it, they they walk, they bicycle, and they whatever. Yeah. So, oh, baby, baby, can you say daddy? Can you say daddy? It's so cute when they say daddy. No, 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 you won't. No, no, no. I don't have no nom. No, no. My nipples. There is no milk in my nipples, Isabel. Pop. <laughs> But um, okay, anyway, uh, maybe I should summarize. How is the high fives the X? This X is wonderful when it comes to uh, as a family car. Uh, unlike the, the set, which is, you know, I mean, you can use it as a family car, but it's, it's more like a sports sedan for people without kids. Um, but <laughs> but um, one, one very big annoyance with the high fives uh, X is that the auto steer is not smooth. Wifey complained about this, that it just, uh, uh, in the curve, it would slow down, but it doesn't, you know, it will slow down kind of sudden, you know? Uh, so she enjoyed the nice seat uh, and the, the comfort in the back there, all the amenities in the back there. But then the, the, the lack of smoothness or the unsmoothness kind of ruined the, the impression of the car. Uh, but but uh, if I drive manual, I can drive it smooth, but then uh, I don't always want to drive manual. So see, this is different between an, a Mercedes EQS SUV that costs twice as much, where the auto steer is smooth. She starts saying Chinese words. No, don't do that. You speak English and Thai and Norwegian, all right? Don't, no Chinese, niche Chinese. Okay, and some German, all right, okay. That, German is fine. Yeah, kaput, kaput is good. All is good. Kaput, yeah, yeah, good. Yeah. Um, but you see, the Chinese, they can do this. I should make a video where I explain to the Chinese people what is wrong with the Chinese car, but also highlight what is good with the Chinese car. There are lots of good things with Chinese cars. Chinese massage is the best. Chinese soundproofing is really good. Chinese features in the car, you get like nice seats, you can recline and stuff like that, you know, also really good. But then Chinese auto steer is some of the worst. And Chinese bing bong is also bad. You know, some cars also Chinese charging is also bad. So, so if, if the Chinese could just nail down this shit, it would be game over for the German car industry. Yeah, freaking game over, man. I'm not joking. Yeah. But until... Uh, ah, yeah, baby. Daddy, hmm? Bell. Can you say again? Daddy. What's your name, baby? No, no. No, no. There's no, there's no daddy milk here. Don't poke my nipples. <laughs> yeah, but. Bit. Mm, bit. <laughs> but, yeah, so, I mean. Some people get the impression that I, I hate Chinese cars. I don't, you know, but I have to be honest, some stuff with the Chinese cars are not good, but some stuff is really good. Huh? Is it kaput? Is it it's not kaput? No, no, it's okay. It's okay, it's okay, it's not kaput. Not kaput. All is good, all is good. Isabel, all is good. Come here. Okay, it's bad. Shun chai, shun chai. Okay, anyway, I think that's gonna be it for now. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. As always, thank you for watching and talk to you later. <laughs>